Good morning from sunny California. Today is the eighth day of the vlog. I know, day eight. I'm surprised just as much as you are. Don't have a whole lot planned today. We're gonna be doing some dishes, cleaning the kitchen up a little bit, watering the trees, and taking Lexi for a walk. I thought I was gonna to go to the dog park today, um, but that's not gonna happen after all. Um, yeah, just a lazy day till work this afternoon at four o'clock. And then hopefully um, I'll be done filming before work starts. That way I can get started editing right after work and then publish it before bedtime. <laughs> I know I've been pushing it as of late, having these videos come out later and later, uh, but hopefully today I get back on track. All right, see you guys along the way. Thank you. So I thought I'd show the backyard today. Uh, not a whole lot to do, so I figured I'd like to try to do some voiceover work. So uh, just gonna do a quick pan in the backyard so everyone can see it. Uh, I'm very happy with how it's turned out. Um, the grass is always green in our backyard. And I'll go through and talk about each of the plants moving forward so we can uh, figure out what, what's what. So as you can see on the ground right now, we have a couple different hydrangeas. I'm gonna zoom in on each of these here. Uh, they're starting to turn green, which is fantastic. They look beautiful when they're blooming. And then we also have our peach tree, which stands nice, big and tall. This is our first tree we've got planted in the backyard. And I think it's fantastic for the summertime. And then you have a shot of all three of them together now. As we slowly pan up, um, I did already cut it at the end of the fall. So yeah, it's already pruned, ready to go for next year. Next up, we have the little lim improved Meyer lemon tree. I don't know if it's written right there, but uh, this guy did produce some lemons with for us this year, and they were tiny, so they worked just fine for us. Next up, we have our pomegranate bush. Uh, I forgot the name there for a second, but it's a very beautiful little bush and produces for us as well. Next, we have a uh, apple tree, which is S. poly A style. So there's four different branches there, and each branch is a different apple type. So I'm curious to see how that turns out. Next up, we have some Daphne's and a plant. I can't recall the name, but it's dead. So we're not going to worry about that one. <laughs> but those Daphne's are perfume princess, and they smell delicious and blooming. And next up, we're going to have the plum tree, which Victoria always calls a another tree, but, but it's a plum tree. And this guy has not produced for us yet. We just planted it, planted it last year. So I'm hoping that it produces a lot of good fruit this coming year for us. And then we have the Portola bush. It's looking a little sad right now, but I did get it standing up st straight with the stake. So let's see how that looks. And then we have a couple different rosemaries, lavender bushes here, the lavender in the front and the rosemary in the back. I believe it's rosemary barbecue, if I'm not mistaken. Um, I could be wrong. Victoria knows better than me. And then in the center, we have a cherry tree. Uh, still a cherry, as it says there. And it's not produced for us yet, but hopefully this year it does produce for us finally. I got it at the same time as the plum tree. And then finally, we have this little planter box that I made for Victoria. and. Yeah, I just got water, so it looks nice and cute. All right, so we finished up outside watering all the trees. Um, I did take some footage of the trees uh, not being watered, just after they got watered. So um, I'm gonna show case all the trees we have here, do a little bit of talking, uh, excuse me, voiceover over the top of that. So you guys can kind of see that. Let me know how you like that. Um, I wanna try a bit more voiceover stuff. So I um, figured this would be a good chance to try that and wash all the dishes, so that's fantastic as well. I don't know if you can hear this or not, but Lexi's over there eating her food right now. I put a uh, sunny side up egg on top of her food and she bit into it after it cooled down a little bit. And then uh, the yolk went everywhere and now she's eating all her food. So, kind of tricked her, happy about that. And yeah, we're gonna start offloading some of this footage and seeing what we have. And then maybe I'll do some more updates as we go through. Don't know about a walk yet today, um, but like I said, I'll try to get some footage of Lexi. So okay, so I changed my mind. Going for a walk after all. <laughs> Um, I was just being lazy, so I figured let's go for a walk now and get this done with. So she's tired by the time work starts today and isn't trying to bug me saying, hey, let's play. Because she sits in my office when I'm working. So, yeah, she's out here just walking around now, smelling everything, doing what she has to do. Have to keep an eye on her, though. Don't know if she's going to do her business or not. So, yeah, we're going to go for a quick walk, about a mile or so um, there, th that way, and then around. And then end up back at home. So 
I'll see you guys as we go through this walk. And if something comes down my mind, I'll definitely post it, okay? There was somebody running and uh, just to be respectful and doesn't want, don't want Lexi chasing after him. I put her back on. <laughs> uh, she was too happy about it, but it is what it is. I usually like to go at this time of day because of the fact that no one's on the trail at all. So I can let her off leash as much as I want to and no one bats an eye. But today was just not our day, I guess. <laughs> Back from the walk, Lexi got dunked her head in water. It was getting really warm, so uh, I saw her pan think a little bit. I'm like, okay, time to go home. So we're back home now. Uh, she, like I said, dunked her head in the water, looked at her food bowls, like, hey, it's empty again. And then I was telling her you ate it all. So uh, she'll get some more food later on today, but she did really good on the walk. I was really happy with her, her uh, performance today. And we'll see what we do the rest of the day. I know I have work starting at four o'clock, so we have about Oh, a little over an hour left before I have to clock in. So I'll probably be doing some more dishes because I made some dirty dishes as I was making my lunch slash breakfast, brunch, brunch. And <laughs> I'll clean that up here before Victoria gets home so that way the house is clean. And yeah, not too much else going on today. Just taking it easy and uh, make sure the house stays clean. Sorry for the late uh, entry here. I just got off work late. Super long day so um that's gonna be our day for today we got to go for a walk you guys got to see the plants which i'm gonna start editing that video and uh see what i can put together and then it should be out tonight probably by 9 30 ish the latest hopefully and so i'm gonna start offloading eat and then post this video so yeah hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see what we have store in store for tomorrow all right everybody have a good night don't forget to like and subscribe